South Dakota lawmakers want to pass legislation aimed at protecting the Black Hills. Senate Bill 21 would create a full-time position within the Department of Agriculture and Natural Resources, which would be tasked with working with forest stakeholders to be a part of the Black Hills National Forest Management Plan revision. State House reporter Austin Goss spoke with those helping to push the legislation and has our story from Pierre. South Dakota lawmakers want to see more involvement from local stakeholders in protecting the Black Hills National Forest. It's why they brought Senate Bill 21. It would bring the five counties in western South Dakota to the table for the resource management plan for the forest. The bill would create a full-time position within the Department of Agriculture and Natural Resources, tasked with coordination between local, state, and federal stakeholders to figure out the best management plan for the forest. Senate Bill 21 is a bill for $950,000. Half of it essentially goes to the Department of Ag and Natural Resources, to the state forester. What we're trying to do is get the state forester involved in managing the Black Hills National Forest. The recent forest plan revision, which is being updated for the first time since 2006, has come under scrutiny by state and local officials in both Wyoming and South Dakota. They have concerns about things like the timber program and fire management by extension. Senator Randy Divert of Spearfish, also a Lawrence County Commissioner, is helping lead the effort. Well, proper, proper forest management reduces wildfire, reduces uh, e e epidemics of, of insects, and properly managed, if you do have a wildfire, you can control it. Uh, your fuel mitigation is part of your plan revision and good operations of the forest, including the timber industry, which is a key tool in proper forest management. The plan covers things like combating invasive species and how much timber can be cut from the forest. But it's a cross-state, local to federal level effort. 430,000 acres of trees were annihilated by the mountain pine beetle. That's because of a lack of forest management, because of a old, old forest management plan. It's uh, my back door, but it's all South Dakota's backyard. And when you go out in your backyard and you enjoy it, because you take care of it, you have success. And that's what we're after, all the multiple uses of the forest. Another appropriations bill on the table would create a volunteer firefighters training facility in the Rapid City area, which certain lawmakers say is also essential for protecting the Black Hills. In Pierre, I'm Austin Goss.